Andy McLaren the 8th of April 2019 Marvin Bartley, a man has been arrested over the incident. A football fan has been arrested after Hibs midfielder Marvin Bartley was allegedly racially abused. The 32-year-old was said to have been targeted during the derby involving Hearts and Hibs on Saturday. A 38-year-old man was arrested and charged for allegedly directing racial language towards Bartley. Hearts have condemned the alleged incident at Tynecastle. Derby, flares and smoke bombs were set off. A club spokesman said, the club abhors racism of any kind and will take appropriate action against any individual found guilty of racist behavior within Tyne Castle. Meanwhile, a 19-year-old man has been charged in connection with throwing a flare while a boy, 16, has been charged for allegedly throwing a coin. The 12.30 p.m. kickoff was delayed as flares and smokes bombs were set off while a coconut was thrown onto the pitch during the game. Coconut, the item was thrown onto the pitch. Hibs beat Hearts 2-1 in their first victory at Tyne Castle since 2013. Earlier this week, Scottish Justice Secretary Humza Yusuf vowed action to improve fan behaviour at football grounds after a pyrotechnic was thrown onto the pitch during St Mirren's game against Celtic. The incident, at the Simple Digital Arena in Paisley on Tuesday night, left St Mirren goalkeeper Václav Haladki badly shaken and requiring attention from the club's medical team after the missile was thrown from the away end of the ground towards his goal. An SPFL spokesperson said in a statement, Racism is completely unacceptable and we fully support any steps taken by our clubs and the authorities to identify those who behave in this manner. Once identified, it's vital that, as well as prompting club bans, such behavior is dealt with severely by the courts. The SPFL wholeheartedly condemns all racism. And, whilst rare in Scottish football, it's something we and our clubs take very seriously. We would strongly encourage supporters who witness any kind of discriminatory abuse to report it to the police. Download the STV News app as Scotland's favourite and is available for iPhone from the App Store and for Android from Google Play. Download it today and continue to enjoy STV News wherever you are.